everyone. We just hit the road. We're going to run a few errands and go to the post office and ship out our Etsy items. And we're going to try to go on a little hike today, get some lunch maybe. Yeah, the Etsy store has been pretty busy with the holiday season, so we're grateful for that. We go by the post office every day. And we were all cooped up yesterday because unfortunately Olivia had an awful migraine. So maybe we can stretch her legs today a little bit. Yeah, it was pretty sucky and I ended up laying in bed all day and it was miserable, but Kyle took care of me and today we are ready to get moving and get out of the camper. So the first stop is the post office. We just left the post office and we're heading into Palm Springs now. Um, there's a hiking trail there that we hiked last year. It's right behind a residential area. And it's not like the best hiking trail ever, but it's got great proximity to kind of the places we're going to be for the rest of the day. Yeah, there is some good elevation on the trail. So once we get up to towards the top of it, we get a good overlook of Palm Springs. So it's a nice shot once you get up to the top, but uh, it's just a pretty uh, thin and rocky trail. One of the big claim to fames that this trail had as we were researching it online is that you can see Bob Hope's home from it. There's a bunch of pretty homes up here. I don't know which one is his. Yeah, but we can give you a view real quick though of some of these houses on the hill. This is our first time back on the hiking trail in about a week and a half. Uh, you know, we're having to warm up to it a little bit. Yeah, we're a little winded. It's a pretty steep trail, but um, it's good to get moving again. So we just got parked and are on our way to Native Foods. It is a really awesome vegan restaurant right here in Palm Springs. So I decided to get the buffalo chicken wrap and a side of fries. It looks really good. I got the big old barbecue burger today. It has vegan bacon and vegan cheddar cheese on it. And we got both of these meals for $10.30 with an online promotion. We just got done eating at Native Foods and it was delicious. Um, we ate there once before already and it is so good. We want to go back a third time soon and we got that awesome discount for signing up for their card or whatever. So and We love our vegan diet and our everyday life, but Native Foods lets us go there and splurge on really these comfort food items that we haven't been able to eat because they're not vegan like the burgers, the wraps, stuff like that. Yep, so it's nice to kind of have um, some of those options we don't get to have regularly. Um, like I'm not typically like a buffalo chicken kind of person, but I can't tell you how long it's been since I've had that type of flavor. And it was fun to get a vegan option and you know they had chili cheese fries and chicken wings and all sorts of different things and it's nice to get those comfort foods every now and then but I think next time we're ready to try something a little lighter <laughs> um, but even as like heavy as those types of foods sound we feel great after eating them and we could never eat like a real big hamburger and buffalo chicken wrap and walk away not feeling queasy or bloated afterwards so and it is a chain restaurant they have a lot of uh branches in Southern California, some in Chicago, one in Portland. 
So if you're in those areas, we'd highly recommend check it out. If you're interested in going anytime soon, definitely go on their webpage. We'll put a link below and they have a buy one, get one free offer if you sign up for their rewards program. I think we spent $10 on our food today. Um, so that's a great deal and it's super filling, big portions. Uh, we, we love it. We're a fan.